the next episode because the last episode we went off and we like we went around the Cyclops, but there was nothing to find. I could go lots of places, but the map kind of ends. You get to a certain point and it just ends, and then there's nothing else on to the rest of it. Which I really hope they update in the future and we get a lot more stuff to explore. Um, this is still not explorable. There is a dev mode of the game that you can get into, like an experimental mode. You can spawn all the creatures if you want. Like you can spawn the big giant creatures in front of you, and you can explode that ship and all this kind of stuff. I, I might do that after, and also I might do like Oculus Rift stuff after a while. I, I want to leave the Oculus Rift stuff away for now because I know some people still want to see the game properly and I want to play it properly. And when you introduce the Oculus Rift, it's really hard to see what's going on or understand anything. But I want to build a base. Um, it was a good idea, like loads of people said it in the comments that I should build a base and I think you're out of power, aren't you? Oh, so we, need, we need a lot of titanium to build a base and we have, yeah, we have this thing. We have this thing, we can build shit if we need to. Right, the Slight Ops might just stay there. It'll be my mobile oppression palace! Please tell me you get that reference. Maria! I am inside you! How are you feeling today? Is your hole all nice and tasty? I think so. Nothing's gonna keep her down. She's 1% of power. Not very good. Right, my sea moth is here, okay. Oh! First things first! <laughs> I'm the realist. <laughs> first things first, I have to eat! God damn, my guy's gonna die. Thank you, Cindy! I know, I keep changing her name from Susie to Cindy. I called her Cindy because that was the name of the girl, or the robot girl in Trials Fusion. Do you remember that game that I was awful at? I know everybody got mad at me. <laughs> I don't blame you. I was fucking awful at the game. But see, that's the thing. I'm awful at most games because that's one of the reasons why, like, I kind of want to play Mortal Kombat X, or Mortal Kombat 10. The X makes it sound cool. <laughs> I kind of want to play that on the channel. But I'm not good at it. I like I've never I've never been good at fighting games. I'm the kind of guy who just button mashes, and that might be frustrating to a lot of the people who are really good at it. So I don't know. But yeah, Trials Fusion was one of those games where you kind of have to be good at the game. What is this thing on your back, Sally? <laughs> it's like a big lever. Why twist that with your head explode? That would be kind of cool. I don't want to do that. Please have copper, copper. Think copper. Think copper thoughts. Joel, why do you think of titanium? Actually, titanium's good. Good job, Joel. For once in your life. So if the Cyclops only has one percent power, uh, it still moves around. I can't, like, I can't use the fabricator in it or anything like that because there's no power for it. But if it has one percent power and I can still dock the sea moth in it, can I still charge the sea moth? That is an experiment I think we're going to have to make. Do where the hell am I going? Where was the things? I want to make my base, like, far away. So, like, my base is over near... The hell was that? Oh, it's just stalkers. It sounded fucking... It sounded much scarier than you guys. <laughs> Go away! Smelly face! Assholes! Always trying to kill me. The only thing about building a base far away is that I need to keep, like, bringing metal back and forth. And I actually have to make titanium with this metal. So I should be just collecting metal right now. Make a long dive, a long deep dive. Oh, but it's a spooky, scary. God. <laughs> oh, things are with a fucker nose. What a nose. Those are creepy. Are you clickety clacking at me? Fucking stop that, please. What are you? Oh. Ah, you're fucking. You're ouchy. You're hurty. I'm, 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 I'm like dying. I'm dying. I'm, I'm. Ow. Ow. Note to self, don't touch the glowy tentacle things. Think after watching enough hentai, I'd know that by now. They, they stick you once and they just keep sticking. Careful, this this game, this turned into a game of operation all of a sudden. You, you go in, you're not allowed to touch the sides. You have to do everything you need, but you're not allowed to touch the sides. If I touch them again, I'm going to die. That uh, brought me down to 11% health. No fucking thanks. Why do I have two knives? Where did I get all- Fuck, I don't need lithium. I need titanium right now. Where is this titanium? Yes! Okay, we head back up. There's a lot of things down here, like a lot of these guys. Thank you! Th thank you! Okay, we, we make a load of trips down here then. You know what, Cindy? I think you only talk to me when I'm in trouble. Yeah, anytime I need a friend, you're not there. But no, every time I have a calorie deficiency or I'm running out of air, there you are. Look at that majestic beast! SS Maria. 
septic sub Maria, as people wanted me to call her. But I liked just having it as Maria, because it sounds more human. And I like that. I like to give them human names. Here we- what am I making? Titanium. I can't even remember what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> also, I got coffee. I love my coffee, man. It goes down smooth. It's not as good as cocaine, though. <laughs> Which everyone seems to think I do. I don't do cocaine. It's too expensive. Heroin is much cheaper. <laughs> There's gonna be some people out there who take me so seriously. You should know by now never to take anything I say seriously. Un unless I'm crying. Which I, I can't seem to go a fan game without crying these days. I can't seem to get to the end of them without crying. The last one I was like, no, I'm not gonna cry this time. I cried at the end of the other one. People are gonna think I'm just a big emotional idiot and I'm, I'm faking it. Nope, the fields were hard, man. When the fields hit you, it's like a fucking train. <gasps> I'm running out, I'm running out. I know, but I need this. Up, up, go. See, Cindy's only talking to me because I was running out of oxygen. I got this, I got this, I'm not gonna die, I'm not gonna <gasps> We made it. Goodbye, sunshine. See you tomorrow, I guess. I'm all alone, in the dark. Oh, that's why you guys light up. I was wondering what your big glowy orange balls were for. You're like, you're like fireflies. Not you guys, though. You guys suck. You guys can just go munch on my dick. But please don't, because that would hurt even more. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, I'm not going in there. Nope, that's full of those fucking sand meal, crash meal guys. Cola and meal please, no bread. Give me some of that creva, man. Give me, give me some of that creva. There's a grape over here. I need to pick up the grape off of the ground. Hey, I won't chop you guys, the, the glowy ones, because you're helpful. This game is cool, isn't it? I really like it. It, it sort of won over my heart all of a sudden. Okay, inventory full. Got a munch in them creep vines, man. One, yes! Cindy, I know! I know! I can see it! You don't need to keep telling me! Is there a way to turn her off? Possibly. Maybe maybe they'll add it later on. I don't know. But this game is cool! I really like it. I'm not just saying it to like make the series sound better or anything. It, it really is cool. I'm so impressed with it. Mainly because it's, it's partly my own fault for having bad expectations for it. I've been so burnt out on so many survival games. So many early access games, actually, not just survival games. But, like, you play so many early access games and they're all the same. And they're all sucky and they all, like, are not finished and don't have cool things in them. Jesus! Um, but this one is really good. Well, I mean, maybe it's because I got into it a bit later. Like, if, uh, I know even my diction played a lot of it before I got near it at all. And he was one of the first people I heard about it from. I'd never seen it from him. But, like, I'd, se I'd seen him, like, just talk about it on Twitter or whatever. Um, oh god, no. Are those things gonna hit me? Don't hit me, please. Don't hit me, bro! I can't fucking see anything. But, I'm sure the game back then was a lot clumsier and a lot, like, less fleshed out than it is now. I don't even know what I'm picking up. Thanks. 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 Should I leave? Is that- I don't know if that's a gap over there that I can leave through. Oh god. Oh god. No. 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 Oh. 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 There's fucking stuff chasing me. And I almost hit those things. And I got like that- I got the tingle up the back of my spine. Ugh. I was hardly gonna get the tingle up the front of my spine. Sunshine! You're back! Hello, sunshine, my old friend. It's good to see you again. It's good to speak with you again. Those were the lyrics. <laughs> right, so I need to bring as much titanium with me as I can to start building my base. I have a lot of tit- Did somebody say you could talk? No! Fucking phone. I've been- I've been doing YouTube for, like, just over two years now. You'd think I'd fucking know how to turn off my phone before I start recording. No, I am doof. Okay, we're gonna bring as much titanium as we can. And leave all this stuff. Because I don't need you. Yet. You're not, you're not- Ooh, I have lots of gold. When did I get lots of gold? I can't remember. Um, salt deposit maybe. Yeah, get rid of my silver because I don't need that. I only need titanium for building. I don't know what direction to put my base in. I'm gonna have, like, have to rely on you guys' help. I mean, we could go straight that way. But we, we've already been over there in the submarine. In the Cyclops. In Maria! Call her by her name. She was christened. She was baptized, not pissed on. Um, See, I, I, I don't know, I have it in my head, like, to just go opposite everything that I already know. 
But I mean, I could go that way. There was a mushroom kingdom over there. That's where Mario lives. That's where I got my lithium. So that might be a cool place to set up shop. Yeah? Wait, should I make a compass? What do I need for a compass? If I can even, like, bring it up. Tank. I don't think I can. Knife, flashlight, builder, welder, terraform. No, because see, I don't have any of the little teeny tiny pieces that go into it, so it just doesn't show up in my thing. Which is bullshit. I'ma just fucking look this up on Mr. Googletron, because- Oh, yeah! The camera on my phone got smashed! You see that shit? I, oh wait, it's supposed to be over here, because I forgot I crop out this whole side of the car- the- my thing. But I was like, oh cool, I got like a new piece for my computer today. I'll take a picture, put it up on Instagram. And I was going to take a picture, and it was all blurry as shit. I was like, what the hell? And I went to wipe my camera, and it's like the whole thing is smashed. Piece of shit. And compass. Why would I need a thermometer? Oh, you can see the thing underneath my power now. Awesome. Just so I, like, know which direction to go in. Until I have my base set up. So we're going... Northeast. Oh, I don't got it. Don't got it. Subtract that from the talkatron. Um, I need to get rid of some shit. Woo! Goody gumdrops! Shit is going down. We're actually doing stuff. We're actually getting stuff done. Um, yeah, right down near the nose of this ship. Maybe as close as we can get without being irradiated. Because <laughs> I, I don't want to get radiation poisoning. It sounds fun. I hear all the kids are doing it these days. You know, like, oh, serious rager, bruh. Did you get your radiation pills? <laughs> but no, Jack don't live that life. Oh, God, it's one of you things. Can you do your whole, like, dig into the ground thing piss off? There we go. See you later, Kabuto. <laughs> I love Kabutos, though. When I was a child, I was terrified of them. You're a different one, though. You're like, you're like an angry giant seahorse. No, thanks. I don't want any. Um, yeah, I, I like Kabuto now, the Pokemon. But when I was younger, he terrified me. That episode with the Kabutos in it? No, thanks. Also, my knowledge of Pokemon. Oh, you have weird faces. Look at all them teeth. You don't need that many teeth. Nothing needs that many teeth. It's the way I don't trust sharks. It's like, you see the amount of teeth those bastards have? And they can regrow them? They've like... Three sets of teeth. Nothing needs that much teeth. Okay, foundation. Oh god, whole game started to have like an aneurysm there for a second. Three times titanium. There we go, you're like half in the ground, I don't like that. Now you're kind of cool. Um, an another foundation, maybe? The foundation is the part that you build your home on. I just don't know what the fuck I'm saying. Of course it's the part that you build your home on. Um... Warning! I'm about to disconnect you and power you down forever! Um, power generator? No. Oh, I could build reinforcements! You and your fucking things! Do I not have a rebreather? I have a rebreather on! Why am I suffering, like, great depth? I, what am I trying to say? Why am I suffering so much from the depth? The depth penalty is what I'm trying to say. I can't English well. I need more coffee. Ah, uh, it's cold! Ugh. Nothing worse than cold coffee. Well, cold soup is also- unless you order cold soup. But if you order hot soup and it comes out and it's cold, you're just like, No. No. Take that shit back. It's like, I'd rather get kicked in the face than drink cold coffee or soup. Um, X Corridor. Ooh, you sound badass. X makes it sound cooler. Uh, how do I rotate you? Here we go. Kinda like a bit of this. No, I want you to be like in the middle. We're out of titanium. But well, we got a good base going. A good base for our base. I'm not sure I like this yet. I'm not sure if I like the shape. I just had stuff down just so I could get a feel for it. Right. Wait, does that show up as like a blinky blinky? No. It don't show up as a blinky blinky. So I'm going to have to remember what, what fucking direction this is in. I think my base will need reinforcements because it's deep. Like it's deep down in the ocean. It's, it's under... It's a... Well, below, but also above 100 meters. It's weird how that works. Um, I, I think I- ah! Go away! Who's- ah! ah! I didn't see him! I thought he was one of those little guys with the suction cup feet! Fucker! Oh, I scared the crap out of me! Never mind! That was my, like, guttural primal scream. Ah! <laughs> wait, wait a second! Wait, 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 wait. This is here? 
The sea moth is right there, okay? And I can go down underneath, but you can't see the sea moths from down below. Can you? Oh! Oh! This, these are the flaps that open. Bad fucking choice of words. <laughs> Those open and the sea moth comes out. That is so cool. Why does it take me a year and a half to figure these things out? Right beside the Mushroom Kingdom, I didn't even realize that. Um, I really should get a beacon. I should like build a beacon, but I'm going to build a power generator now. And then I can actually put a fabricator inside this thing. Power generator. Here you go. Can I put you somewhere cooler? You kind of just float there and I don't like it. Spadoosh! Cool! Oh yeah! There's where the fuel cells go. I hear you. Oh, I need to make a hatch. A hatch. A hatch. I don't have the glass for it. God damn it. Here he comes. Here comes Speed Racer. He's got the biggest booty in town. That's, that's not how the song goes. <laughs> I actually don't know the real lyrics. I just keep singing it that way. <laughs> what are you? What the hell did I just pick up? You're kind of cute though. He looks like a septic eye. He's like the most... Sam looking thing that's been in this game so far. If I could just sit you on my shoulder, I'd be happy. But you'd probably bite me or something, wouldn't you? You look like you have a spiky tail. There's also apparently an island is in this game that I should try and find sometime. I don't know where it is. Yes, I'm getting pretty sick of listening to you. Um, I should figure out where it is. Apparently, as I, I keep saying apparently, I say that because I keep learning all my stuff from like the internet and from the comments from you guys. So everything's apparently because I don't know. <laughs> But you're supposed to be able to find it. Or you're supposed to be a uh, a giant floater underneath it. I hear ya. I hear ya. I need to get titanium. It's supposed to be a giant floater underneath it, keeping the whole island up, which would be so cool to see. Right. So our fabricator is going to go. Fa fabricate. Where's it? Fabricator. Fabricator is going to go here, R right there. Hooray! Now we can actually build shit down here. Hey, hey you! Big red lips! Stay the fuck away from my base! I might put another hatch right here. So, the base is kind of done. Kind of. We need to get in and look around. Can I pick you up yet? Yes! Here we go. Cool! I need to attach something here. Or put something here. Maybe my thing can go here. My, my storage cube? Aw, oh, didn't my base look cool? I should, you know what I should have done? Ah! Oh. <laughs> It'd be so fucking cool to make a base that actually spelled boss. If I had enough time or something, like you could actually make it do like the B-O-S-S. -S. They wouldn't be connected and it'd be kind of pointless to do that. It'd be a big waste of resources, but it'd be so cool to have like a base that actually said boss. I might do that later on. I just want to get a base done, but I was thinking that if I put stuff on top of another, like if I put... You just fuck away. Are you afraid of the lights? Go away! Ah, I'm a scary human! Oh, he does not give a fuck! Go away! Go away, you big hairy bitch! But if I put another piece on top of another piece, then I could just like put a hatch on that. So I'd, I'd essentially, they wouldn't be connected, like I wouldn't be able to go from base to base while inside. But I'd be able to come out and go into the next one. So I'd have, like, essentially I could build like a, a base scraper. A, a sea scraper. A skyscraper, but underwater. So here's the tip when you're playing this game. When it says that the game is about to crash, do not save your game in your sea moth and then exit the game. Because when you come back, the sea moth will not be a physical entity and trying to fix it will make your sea moth disappear. So I have no more sea moth anymore. It's just gone. And I go to the game up and it's not here anymore. Fuck's sake. This is a magma vent. I'm gonna try and get this quartz. Oh God, oh God, oh God. No, what can I drop? What can I drop? I can't really drop anything. I have a lot of quartz already. 30 seconds of oxygen. I can make it to my base. Get inside. Actually, I have loads of time. What am, what am I talking about? Why am I freaking out? <laughs> is my, is my Seamoth here? No? Thanks. Fucking fantastic. So glad that that disappeared. Hey, all the things I had here are gone. I had like stuff placed that I was getting ready to put up. I was putting a window here. Ding! That decreases your strength, which I assumed it would. I, I want to like put windows on the on the outside just so I can like look around. So I look out in the mushroom kingdom out here. Is it? Can I crouch? No, but that's cool. 
Uh, I need to add some more reinforcements, so how much glass do I have? I can add one more window. That's a lie. I can add two more windows. Never mind. Our whole strength is going way down. Oh, this is cool. This actually feels like a proper little base. I don't know why I have, like, all this section. There's nothing here. There's no need for any of it. I want to put another hatch there. Oh, I like this. Uh, I need to put up some more reinforcements, though. Just to make it stronger, because the whole thing just doesn't collapse. Because we are at a depth of 168 meters. Which is pretty damn deep. There we go. We have reinforcements on the inside of the base. So, like... It's all inside, so like, even if there were windows there, you couldn't really see anything. You'd just be looking in on top of the base. And all the windows are on the outside. I might extend the base out this way. Or maybe put, like, another window there. This is cool! I don't really get why you... Like, a base is cool because you can put the fabricator inside it. But I don't really get why you'd need one apart from that. Unless you can dock, like, your submarine and your sea moth and that around. But there's hatches here. Maybe I can build on top. Okay, well I'm gonna leave this video here. Next episode we're gonna continue on building our base. I might try and build some more stuff that's in the game. I keep comparing it to Stranded Deep, which I probably shouldn't, and I'm sorry if that gets annoying. But it's the closest comparison I have to it, because they're both like Stranded in the Ocean kind of games. And they do go for very different things. Stranded Deep is supposed to be a more realistic away kind of thing where you're supposed to feel isolated and this is very far removed from that where you can build a big submarine on your own just in the, in the middle of nowhere but like in Stranded Deep one of the reasons I never build bases in them is because there's no point the whole map or the whole world is completely infinitely randomized and there's no point of building a base in one place and then moving off to somewhere else because you, you just leave your base then and you spend a, such a long time creating that base that you can't like really find it unless you really know where it is um, but this, you can like set up a beacon, you can go back to it. There's a reason to have a base here on the edge of like the mountain or the mushroom place. And you can go off and get more materials and you can build stuff. You, know, you can use your base as like another, like Henry away from Henry kind of thing. It's very, very useful to have another base. And it looks cool and it feels cool to build it. And it's not as cumbersome or time consuming. So, I, I don't know, I, I think this game is doing a lot of things really, really right. And I can't wait to see what they're doing with it in the future. I really hope they update it soon. So there's a lot more content to it. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch the like button in the face. Like a buzz. And bye bye all round. Well, thank you guys. And I will see all you do.